Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sandy and this is Topic Beauty. Today we are going to have some fun with the new Glam Light Collection Frosted Flakes. It took me a little bit to get my hands on this. I ordered it the day it came out, but there was a little bit of delay in the shipping. So I have it now. We're going to play with it. See you soon. Hello. I got some goodies today. As you can see inside this box is the Glam Light Frosted Flakes um, collab. I'm going to zoom in a little bit here. Okay. My face is kind of on. I'm a little smudgy here. Um, my eyes are primed. We are going to go ahead and open this cuteness up. Um, everybody knows about Tony the Tiger. Um, this is cute. It looks like a cereal box. Look at the top. Cute. Um, I'm going to open it from the bottom though, because it seems like the easiest way. <laughs> um, here's the palette inside. Look at that. That is so cute. We are going to put that on our eyes today. Throwing shit on the floor. All right. We'll get to the other stuff in a minute. It's two lip sets and a highlighter. We'll get to those. I'm going to grab this brush here from Makeup Institute Los Angeles. It is a PG-10. I used it yesterday, but I'm using a similar color, so I'm going to use it um, right now. I'm going to... I am dropping stuff. This is... Not... I'm going to take the plastic sheet off. I didn't even see it. I'm going to dip into this color right here. I think it's called Crunchy. It is... Tap off the extra. I'm just going to put that... You guys know I love Glam Light. I've done a video on my channel in the past on my Glam Light collection so far. And that collection has grown a bit. There are a couple of collections that they did that I did not buy, like the Hershey collection. I didn't buy that. Oh, this is nice. Got this smaller, that's not smaller. Eh, yeah, it is. Hank and Henry Bianca brush. I am going to grab this color blue in the corner. It's called Go Getter. I'm just going to hit the outer corner with that. Oh, I went up too far. Dang it. Okay, we can fix that. That's okay. This is a pretty color. It's like a blue almost gray it looks anyway in this light maybe it's never even and then i gotta play catch up <laughs> anyway you guys know i love glam like there's a couple of palettes of theirs that i do not have but i have a lot of their products and i wish i used them more because i really do love them but I have so much that I wind up just moving on, um, which I should really start thinking about knocking that, knocking that shit off. <clears throat> I don't need to be spending all this money on makeup. Um, all right. I think I'm going to go back to that original brush and grab, oh, I just stuck my fingernail in it, damn it. Guys, I don't know. This camera's freaking me out. It's making me not want to do videos because I don't like I don't like it. It takes too long to focus. It only focuses on my face. Everything looks funny to me. I don't I'm not in love. I'm not in love. Alright, I'm gonna take this. No, I'm not gonna take that.
All right, I just got this flat brush from Morphe. It doesn't have a name. So anyway, I was saying, um, <clears throat> I don't know. The camera's not fun. I don't like it. I liked it, and then I don't like it, and maybe I'll go back to liking it again once I get more used to. I don't know. I'm just going to put this over my lid. I'm going to smudge it a little bit into the blue. I don't want to make it muddy, so I'm not going to go all crazy. There's this cute shimmer color in there called Tiger Paw that I'm going to grab. Maybe I'll do another video updating my um, my Glam Light collection because I think everybody should dig into this Glam Light collection because it's so cute. This is Tiger Paw right here. I'm going to pick it up with my finger. And I'm just going to put that right over my lid because you know I like. I've got to have shimmers. I'm gonna zoom in a little more, I think. Even though the, the whole screen is filled up with my big fat head. Not that I need to, but I want to. I'm gonna pick up this color right here called Blue Nose. It's kind of shimmery. It's it's more like a oh I forget what it's called. It's a matte with a little bit of like glittery reflect in it. The glitter in it looks really, really fine. So I'm just going to pick it up on that Morphe brush on the other side. And I'm just going to go right over that. Just to see if... I just want to see if the glitter fades away. It's there, but I bet if I blend it out a lot, it'll go away. And I think I'm going to use it under my eye like along my lash line going back to that PG 10 brush and we are gonna pick up this color right here it looks like my skin tone slightly more orange than my skin tone but I think it'll work out we're gonna pick that up tap it off and just do right under the lash line and bring it all the way into the inner corner I always take whatever color I do up here, sort of under here, like under the color, not really using it to blend the color. I just think it makes it look more natural to my skin. Whatever color it is, I do that. I just think it makes it look sort of like my skin all blended into the makeup rather than the makeup blended on my skin, if that makes any sense. but. I've been told many times that my makeup looks like it's part of my face rather than on my face. And I like that because that's my goal when I do my makeup from Alamar Cosmetics. I'm going to use this flat brush and I'm going to pick up Blue Nose just on the tip of the brush. Tap off the extra because you know how I like to make a mess with blue eyeshadow. I'm only going in as far as my lash line, and then I'm going to just sweep it. I like it. I've been asked where to hold the brush. <clears throat> I hold it in different spots depending on where I'm going. You have to figure out your feel. Um, a lot of people will hold it just on the end. I can't unless I'm doing really fluffy work. Um, or otherwise, I hold it kind of here. And then I just, light pressure on your eyes. I say light pressure and half the time I'm mashing the shit out of my face. Okay, with the same brush, I just cleaned it off on a towel and picked up this color. They're great. I just wanted a little, a little softer blend from the blue to the inner corner because I'm going to use, I might regret it because it's very white, this color milk right here on the inner corner. And I'm going to pick it up with this ColourPop E27 brush. It's just a, a utility brush. I'm just 
just going to pop that right in the inner corner. Might have to, I was going to say I might have to zhuzh it up with my finger, but that worked. The second sweep worked. Clumsy. Bl um, this black right here looks super nice. It's called Tiger Stripes. I want to use it, but I like the way this looks as is. So I'm going to show some restraint for once in my life and not use it. I'm going to do my brows and I'll be back. Okay, in this collection, there is a highlighter. A little milk carton. It's cute. I'm going to open it from the bottom. It's a loose highlighter in the color... Does it have a name? It doesn't have a name. Um, oh my god. Look at the... It's a cereal bowl. See, that's what I'm talking about. Glam Light is so cute. What's going on? There's something flashing over in the corner. I don't know. I hope it's recording. It has the little thing. We're going to pop that off. All right. I'm going to shimmy shake a little bit out of there more because nothing happened okay all right it's a really Let's see if we can get it to work oh it's working it's dark though um that's better it's like a goldy yellow maybe all right we're gonna pick it up on a highlighter brush the highlighter brush i'm going to use is lbf6 from lunar beauty we're gonna pick that up. I'm gonna do it on my hand because I wanna see, because it looks like it might almost be casty. There it is on my hand. I like it. I'm gonna do it. If I mess up my face, I'm gonna be so pissed. I have, I believe I have a, a highlighter from Glam light and I very rarely use it. And oh yeah, it did exactly what I thought it was gonna do. It's super cute like that, but then oh actually it's not too bad. <clears throat> it's not exactly what I'd hoped for. Oh gosh. It goes on cakey. I don't like that. Well their eyeshadows are super cool. Why does my face look like it has lines in it? It probably does because I was actually sleeping before I started getting ready. I'm going to put some on my lips. Okay, so what I did is I took a brush that I've applied bronzer with. There's no color on it, but there is residual because it's not a clean brush. And I just kind of brushed over where I had put the highlighter. And it's not as bad um i think it toned down that glare and i call it a glare rather than a glow because it didn't look glowy and shiny and pretty it just looked like the light was shining on the window and it wasn't cute it wasn't cute so all right we got two lip kits Ben, where are you going? Where are you going? I'm going to pull this little tab and pull that out. This is a... It's cute. It's like a lip gloss with a pencil. <clears throat> Hi. And then we've got this one, which is a lipstick and a pencil. <coughs> Excuse me. The lipstick is an orangey nude, at least for my skin tone. And I just want to see this pencil. Oh, this is a this is a nude color pencil. Wrote on my hand with it. 
I'm gonna go right in my hand with the other one that came with the lipstick. So the more brown one, this one here, came with the nude lipstick and the other one came with the gloss. Which the gloss is so pretty. I do like Glam Lights lip products. Let's see if it'll focus. See that? That's the gloss. This over here is the highlighter. The gloss is so cute. I'm gonna line my lips with the darker of the two, which is the one that came with the nude lipstick. Oh, you can't even see me. Hello. What's happening? Okay, see, that's the annoying shit that I'm talking about with this camera. I gotta figure out why it does that. Is it me? What is it? I'm not gonna lie, this pencil's dry. I'm gonna sharpen it, even though it doesn't need to be sharpened. I'm just gonna take off, see what happens. Um, it's a nice color and it goes on but I ain't gonna lie, it's work. Can't say that I like it. It's dry, it was work, and now my lips feel dry. I'm going to give it a minute and put the lipstick on and see what happens. <clears throat> I don't have any of their bullet lipsticks, so this is going to be the first time I'm trying this. Color's cute. It feels matte. It's very drying. Look at my lips. In the camera, I can't tell if it it blocked the light from my eyes. My lips look very creasy. They look huge though. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I don't know. I don't know if I, I don't want to wear it. I don't want to wear it because I have to wear it for a long time. Oh, the more I rub it in. No, I don't like it. I'm taking it off. Okay, so the lip liners, lips, the bullet lipstick is a no. They have liquid lipsticks that I've used. I have a lot of them and I like them a lot. They're glosses I definitely like, so I'm probably going to use the gloss. Um, It looks almost the same color as the the milk inner corner that I did on my eyes. Um, I don't know. That's disappointing. The highlighter, not a fan. Not a fan. Definitely love this. Show you the inside one more time. Very cute. So pretty. But it's blue, it's orange, and I like that. So I am going to use, I gotta bring my ass up there. Hold on, I'll be back. <laughs> All right, I like that, that's cute. I'm gonna try the lip gloss from the Frosted Flakes collection. Put it directly on my lips, which I never do, but I'm just gonna wipe off the applicator on my trusty towel actually I like that that's really cute I'm gonna dip back in and use my finger because I like I like this little trick applying it with the finger 
and f like let's see if I can explain it kind of fluffing it toward the edge of the lip a little trick where's my wipey a little trick that I learned from watching Scott Barnes um, stay tuned for a stay tuned for a video with not with him <laughs> With his makeup, I have a whole bunch of it, and I am in love, loving everything that I've touched from that man so far. Okay, I already recapped the eyeshadow. I love the eyeshadow palette. It's really, really cute. I'm gonna go ahead and spray my face again, but <clears throat> this time I'm gonna spray my face with Kimchi Chic Beauty Stage Proof Matte Setting Spray. I don't care what anybody says about this makeup line. It's good and the setting spray is phenomenal. Okay, that's the face. I'm loving the lips. Mm. Love them, they're so cute. The eyes, love, super cute. Great eyeshadow. Great eyeshadow palette from Glamlight. Again, never disappointed. Maybe I'll do another video, I think I already said this. I'll do another video updating my Glam Light collection because it's grown since the last time I did one. My dog's coming downstairs. Come on, Benny. Good girl, come here. Good girl. Good girl, you always want to come downstairs. <clears throat> anyway, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Down below, hit that button, that bell button, that bell notification bell so that you know when I upload a video next. See you in the next one, bye.